Hello and welcome to the automated box folding machine. In front of you, you can see a diagram of the gantry for the uh, box folding machine. And you can see that we have limit switches located in various positions throughout the gantry. Um, these operate as physical stops in the controls um, to continually update the position of the gantry to the Arduino board. And so um, I've made a little controls simulation uh, because obviously we don't have the full scale um, and that's right here. And so while you're watching this video, uh, maybe even pull up uh, the, the diagram that you just saw uh, so that you can kind of follow along with me. But uh, the, the switches are labeled, the limiting switches are labeled A through E. Um, and those are represented here, A, B, C, D, E, um, in this simulation. And this here represents a stepper motor um, that is rotating. Um, and this, in the, in the vertical direction, and this represents a horizontal stepper motor moving in the horizontal direction on the gantry. So I'll go ahead and demonstrate what the uh, simulated movements look like right now. So first we're gonna be moving upward to C, um, vertically moving upward to start the sequence. So I'm gonna click that, and once that limit switch is hit, the horizontal motion is going to go negatively until we hit limit switch A, so I'll do that. Now vertical comes down, oh, uh-oh, we lost a switch, that's okay, I'll stick that back in. So now vertical motion is going downward until we actually hit a box. So that's going to be limiting switch D. It pauses and the vacuum pin over there initializes, meaning that we have vacuum. And now we have contact with A and D until we come to C again. Now we lose our contact with A, but um, C and D are still made contact with because we're at the top of our vertical span and we still have contact with the box until we get to the other side of the gantry and we hit button B. Now we've lost contact with C and now we're moving downward until we hit the bottom limit of our vertical gantry, which is going to be E. Everything stops, the vacuum pin disengages. Now I let go of D and now vertically it goes back upward again. Uh, and now I can let go of, I'm sorry, now I can let go of E as well because we're moving upward. Um, now vertically we're going upward and then it starts the process all over again once we hit C. And now B is off. And that's it. Thanks everyone.